And good evening. Thanks for joining us on this holiday. I'm Craig Andrus. Jeff and Emily have the night off. Tragedy today in Dodge City. It's our top story. Damian Mendez went for a run Sunday night, never made it back. Family says he died from what appears to be a heat related issue. Mendez won state titles and was well known. KSN's Hannah Adamson talks with the family. It's new at 10. Craig, Damien's loved ones tell me he pushed himself to the limit every single time. Following a remarkable high school wrestling career, he was on his way to pursue his passion at North Dakota State University, a future tragically cut short. God wanted him with him. No matter what, it was his time and God needed him. The Kansas high school wrestling community in shock following the death of Damian Mendez, named the 6A wrestler of the year. He had a way of just being a good coach to all his teammates and, co and coaches. Damian was an amazing friend and an even better brother. Damian's family to me. Damien will always be family. A lifelong athlete, Mendez participated in football, soccer, and track, also making regionals for cross country. By high school, Mendez set his sights on the mat, making four state appearances, winning three state titles. Yeah, you go work hard every day to get better and better. I've never been around anyone that worked as hard or wanted it as much as he did. Mendez also wrestling 126 in the 2022 NHSCA High School Nationals becoming a national champion. Probably goes down as one of the most dominant wrestlers in Kansas ever, not giving up a, a single offensive point, you know, the last two years of high school career. The impact of his death felt well beyond Dodge City. The influence he had on how many coaches and, and just wrestlers from all over the state have been texting and, and sending their love. And, and Damien was everyone's. He, he loved the wrestling community. And it's nice to know that, that other people loved him as well. The Dodge City wrestling team has set up a meal train for Damien's parents. If you would like to help, we have a link with more information on our website. That's KSN.com. Here for you, Hannah Adamson, KSN News 3.